glad you're here. Would you like to help me act out my story? Then place my special flashlight in my paw. This story is called Scaredy Bear of the Dark. I was so excited. It was opening day for the new Sammy Space Bear movie. Sammy Space Bear vs. Grizzly Buck. And Daddy was taking me to see it. We made it to the front of the line and I said, Two for Sammy Space Bear, please. Along with the tickets, we got a special surprise. An official Sammy Space Bear button. Wow! I put on my button and we went inside and found two seats. After we sat down, it got really, really dark. So I held Daddy's paw tight. The movie was terrific. Two paws up. Grizzly Bot was an evil alien robot with sharp, snapping claws and a glowing eye. When he popped out and tried to get Sammy, everybody jumped. Daddy even spilled his popcorn. That night at dinner, we couldn't stop talking about the movie. Daddy liked how real the alien robot looked. He held a yellow cup up in front of his face and said, Ooh, click, clack, ooh, I will get you, Sammy Space Bear. I like the part when Sammy said, It's time for a Sammy Whammy! And that Grizzly Bot with his laser light, Bazaoui! Grizzly Bot turned around and sped back to his space cave. That night, after Mommy tucked me in, my room seemed darker than usual. I was just falling asleep when I heard a noise. Ooh, click, clack, woo. It sounded like Grizzly Bot was right outside my window. I pulled the covers up over my head so he couldn't find me. When I didn't hear his scary noise for a while, I peeked out. <gasps> but there, right next to the window, was the shadowy shape of Grizzly Bot. I ducked under the covers, but when I peeked out again, I saw an eye blink open right beside my bed. I yelled, Ah! It's Grizzly Bot! And in a flash, I was out of bed and halfway to Mommy and Daddy's room. I ran into their bedroom yelling, Mommy! Daddy! Grizzly Bot is in my room! Mommy gave me a big hug. She said, There, there, my little dreamer bear. It was just a movie. Daddy held my paw and walked me to my room. There are no robots here, TJ, but I have this for you. He put something in my paw. It was a flashlight. Daddy said, We're right down the hall if you need us, TJ. But if you get scared again, just turn on the flashlight. Good night, my brave bear, he said. Then he gave me a kiss and went back to his room. I decided I could be brave, just like Sammy Space Bear. I thought, if that robot comes back, I'll give him a Sammy Whammy. I switched off the flashlight and tried to go back to sleep. Just when I was sure that robot was gone for good, I heard the noise again. Ooh, click, clack. Ooh, but this time I was ready. I pointed the flashlight at the window.
window. The tree outside was moving in the wind. <laughs> the wind! That's what was making the woo-woo noise. And the click-clack was just a small tree branch tapping on the glass. <laughs> it was nothing to be scared of. I pulled the covers up to my chin and rolled over to go to sleep. But there it was again. The shadowy shape by my window. What do you think it was? Quick as a laser beam, I aimed the flashlight across my room. It was just my jacket hanging on the back of a chair. Maybe it was just a movie after all, I said, and tried to go to sleep. But just then, a golden flash of light caught my eye. I knew it could only be one thing. Grizzly Bot's glowing eye. Okay, you sneaky robot. It's time for a Sammy Whammy. I pointed the flashlight right at him. But guess what? There was no robot at all. All I saw in the light was my Sammy Space Bear button. I turned off the flashlight and looked around my room. The tree, the chair, and the button just looked different in the dark. There was nothing to be scared of at all. When I woke up the next morning, I felt so proud. I had made it through the whole night by myself. I wanted to remember my brave night and how the flashlight helped me. I put the flashlight into my story box and said the special rhyme Grampy Bear taught me. I placed this keepsake in the box. A future story it unlocked. Any more trouble last night? I laughed and said, Haha, Grizzly Bot didn't stand a chance thanks to your bright idea. The end. That was terrific. Do I do I do I do I do I do I? I'm not afraid of the Light shines just like the sun. I'm making shadows on my wall and I have no fears. And I can make the shadows look like bunny ears. I'm just so busy having fun. Yeah! I'm not afraid of the dark anymore. Now I am brave and counting sheep. Whistling through the trees just like a choo-choo train. Think I will ride it off to sleep. Good night, it's time to go to sleep. Let's play a game called TJ Says. The way to play is to do what I say. Are you ready to go? Let's play! TJ says... Pretend you're the sneaky robot Grizzly Bot and jump up high in the air. Higher! Yeah! Move your arms like a robot. <laughs> Make robot sounds. Ooh, click, click, ooh. <laughs> Keep up the good work. It's time for one of my favorite games. I'm thinking of something. Can you guess what it is? Let's go. I'm thinking.
thinking of something that Daddy gave me that helps me be a brave bear at night. 